Hi guys, welcome back to my kitchen. I know it's been a while. I must apologize. I haven't been on this platform as much as I'd like to or as much as some of my other platforms. So I do apologize. I'm here today. I'm actually, it's Friday, April 5th, and I just got back from my local farmer's market. So I thought I'd show you what I got from the farmer's market today. I haven't really done a farmer's market haul video aside from maybe a short or two. I'm not sure if I've even got one on here, but I thought since it's out on my counter, I will um, show you what I got. Okay, with it's hard to kind of fit everything in frame, but I'm gonna do my best here, guys. Um, okay, I'll start over here. I picked up three bags of chicken skins. So these are amazing. Um, it actually fills up two cookie trays for me, like two, not cookie trays, but baking sheets. And I bake these in the oven. I think I do have a video on that or a short, but yeah. So this like whole bag yields me so many chicken skins and I picked up three bags. Um, I'm going to keep one out and I'm going to freeze the other two. I really like these ready to eat, um, beef garlic rings. They are clean ingredients, no gluten and sugar. So I really like them. I picked up two of those. Um, I did pick up some eggs from the Hutterites and they were giving out some salami. I did buy some veggies there as well, but they were giving out some um, beef salami. So I thought that was really nice. My, my cream bottle made my egg carton a little messed up there. So I got some eggs, uh, a free thing of pepperoni salami. So that was really nice. My um, kids really like flank steak. I usually grill it and I'll, um, when, when unraveled, cause it's folded up right now, it's, it's about that long and I'll just season it and grill it. But my kids really do like this. And it is, how many kilograms is this? Just under a kilogram then, 0.9 kilograms. But, so that's a favorite in this house. Um, some beef Maui ribs or short ribs or Korean ribs or whatever you would call them. Got a package of those. My kids really like those too. Um, I almost wish the packages were bigger and that was actually the only one they had left. This is hanger steak. So this is new to me this year. Like the, um, the farmer I get the hanger steak from um, started carrying it and I've never really tried it before that. And I really, really enjoy it. Actually, the whole family does again. I, um, I think it's not as desirable of a cut, but I season it and then grill it. And yeah, we really enjoy it. The price is not bad. Again, just under a kilogram for that. Um, I should note that I'm in Canada too. So this is Canadian dollars. If you were paying American, it wouldn't be this, this much because our dollar is not worth as much, unfortunately. Um, <laughs> Okay, and so this is skirt meat that I picked up. Um, the price isn't on here because they forgot it, but they did the calculation and it was it was $10 for this. Um, again, another thing I tried this year that I really never tried before because it's not something I'd find at my grocery store. Um, yeah, so the kids like this too. I'll season, um, throw it on the grill, and we um, just kind of slice it up and delve in and everybody kind of shares it that way. Back here is a beef heart. So I don't, I don't love beef heart, but it is good to include in our diet. So I actually don't mind it done um, via beef jerky. And Lila really loves beef heart jerky. So I did pick up a heart. This is um, 1.4 kilograms. You do, we do get quite a bit of uh, jerky from a heart. So I haven't actually done a, a heart jerky in quite a while. And I believe I, I have a video on that too. I can't remember. I think I do. It's probably from a couple years ago. Um, I'll look and if I do, I'll include it below. So in the back there, We've got veggies, um, a big bag. So it's four for 22 from the Hutterite. So that's where I got the eggs and the salami. So it's four big bags for 22 or $6 a bag. I did the four for 22. So I've got potatoes back there, um, carrots. The kids love the carrots and we're not, we don't do baby carrots a whole lot here. So they really do love the carrots. We go through quite a bit. We go through quite a bit of cucumbers. I got a big bag of cucumbers. I think there's six in here. Um, 
And a three pack of cucumbers at my Costco is I believe $5.99. So this is a really great, a great deal because you get six in there, two big bags of carrots and the big bags of potatoes in the back. And so I'm gonna come over here to the cream now. I think that's it. I think we've got all the meat, yes. Okay, so I love this whipping cream. It's 35%. It's got clean ingredients. I'm gonna try to find the ingredients here for you. Where is it? Um, it's just that my um, local heavy cream at my grocery store has carrageen and xanthums in it. So. I love that this is milk and cream. It's 35%, it's processed at a low temp. It is so yummy and I love it in my coffee or whipping whipping cream up. So yeah, that's that. And then I also get this heavy cream, which is a 52%. This is much more than this, a cost-wise too, because this is $20. And I know you're thinking that's a lot and this is nine dollars i believe but the thing is at my grocery store so let's say i went to walmart or superstore heavy creams like 6.99 like regular heavy cream with carrageen and stuff in it it's 6.99 um and this is like nine dollars and it's organic and it doesn't have the ingredients i don't like in it this stuff is so thick guys this heavy cream at 52 percent it is so um, it is so good though. Again, this is, um, organic cream. That's it. That's the only ingredient. No carrageen or, um, I can't even remember all the other stuff that's in the one at, um, the grocery store. So I love this and it's, um, they are both, um, pasteurized at a low temp. So you're not losing all those, all those, um, beneficial bacterias or whatnot. So it really is yummy. I love this one in coffee too, like just to drizzle and line my cup. It's, it's, it's good. So that is my farmer's market haul guys. I hope you enjoyed watching. Um, I hope you liked this sort of thing. And again, I know I haven't really done a farmer's market haul. If you did like seeing it, let me know. Maybe I'll do another one in the future. What I usually get stays pretty consistent. I didn't get chicken wings this time. Usually I sometimes do. Like every other time they have a um, variety pack that I, or not a variety, what do they call it? An economic pack. It, they're frozen. And there's like four packs like this. Um, and what is that? Usually it's usually about 30 bucks for the four froze and they're frozen. And they're like that. I didn't get that today. Sometimes I get the grass fed beef hot dogs. I should note that all the uh, beef that I did get is um, from a farmer that I usually stop there. They're, they raise their animals humanely, they're grass fed, um, clean, clean um, sources or whatnot. I really do like their products and I've been there just, I've been buying from them for over two years. So I do really like them and I like how they do some processed meats. They even do beef bacon. They didn't have beef bacon today, but I like how they don't add like gluten and stuff I don't like. So I really do enjoy it. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video too. Again, if you do want to see more content like this, let me know. If not, no worries either. You can let me know that too. Um, I do hope to get on here more and we will see you soon. Thanks for watching guys. Have a good weekend.